Hello students, in this video we are going to learn how to create a simple game in Scratch. Okay, so as you are able to see that here some steps are given. I am first telling you about this game, okay, that what kind of game it is and we will follow these steps one by one as it is given in the proper manner here, okay. So in this game a balloon rises from the bottom and you have to aim and burst the balloon before it disappears to win the game okay so in this game what is going to be happen a balloon will come up on your screen from the bottom it's rise from the bottom and you have to aim to that balloon and you have to burst the balloon before it disappears to win the game okay so as it is explained in the game that balloon will come okay so first you have to create one balloon sprite and you have to create one more costume of that particular balloon sprite as a busted balloon okay so balloon will be same there will be a two costumes one is the complete balloon and second one is the busted balloon okay now you have to write the script for both of balloon so you have to write one script for a balloon and you have to write one script for a aim sprite okay so in this game there are two sprites one is balloon and one is aim balloon is having two different costume and one more sprite is there whose name is aim sprite okay so step one Select new from the file menu, delete the default sprite displayed on the stage, click on the button paint new sprite, okay. So here I am going to show you the practical of this thing. So what you have to do, you have to delete this sprite, okay, as you can see this delete icon is there. So you can delete this sprite. Now you have to go to this option, choose a sprite and you have to click on here this paint sprite option, okay. So when you click on this paint, what is going to be happen? This paint option will be open okay now in the step 2 in the paint editor draw a balloon as shown and name the sprite as balloon select the don't rotate icon in the sprites information as shown below to keep the balloon upright okay so now what we have to do we have to draw this kind of balloon and this is the balloon information so what we have to do we have to click the don't rotate icon to keep it upright okay so i am going to show you how we can do this okay so come again in your scratch screen and draw a balloon so suppose i am going to draw a balloon here okay so now fill the color in the balloon okay so like this so here your balloon is uh, created now in the in the information what you have to do you have to give the name of this sprite so I am going to give the name of this sprite so here I am writing the name balloon okay I had written the name here in the sprite section now click the don't rotate icon to keep it upright okay so here go to direction and do not rotate okay so I had click on the do not rotate option okay now my balloon is there on my screen okay as you can see this is the balloon now we have to follow the next step that is go to the costume tab and right click the balloon sprite okay select the duplicate option to create a new costume then click the new costume to edit it so come again to your scratch screen here this is the costume one so click on the this costume right click on the costume click on the duplicate so you can see costume 2 is there okay so now you have to create a new costume for this balloon okay now step 4 change the new costume to that of a bursting balloon as shown by using the eraser and tool name the costume as balloon 2 okay so you have to uh, erase some part of this balloon as it's look like a busted balloon okay so here here the costume name is balloon okay and the costume 2 name is balloon 2 okay so these are the name of costume now you have to erase it by using the eraser so this is my eraser make it little small 
okay like 20 and then erase it like this like this okay so now your balloon is busted like this okay so this is your costume 2 so this is your costume 1 and this is your costume 2 okay now create another sprite as shown below for aiming at and bursting the balloon and call it aim shrink the aim sprite to a smaller size okay so now you have to create this second sprite okay so now what i have to do i have to go to this now we have to again click on choose a sprite then go to paint a sprite okay now you have to give the name of this sprite as a aim i am giving the name here aim okay here i am giving the name aim okay here i have to create the sprite so first you have to draw a circle okay so you do not have to fill it okay so you have to make it empty okay so like this you have to create your aim You have to select outline. Okay, suppose your outline is black. Make it little bit larger. Okay, like this. So this is your aim. Okay, now create some lines over here line will be in the red color change the color okay so like this you have to create aim sprite now the next thing is now create the following script for the sprite balloon and aim okay so this you have to create for the balloon and this you have to create for the aim so first we will write for the aim so this is my aim right now my sprite aim is selected okay as you can see here i am writing the name aim okay so right now my sprite aim is selected okay so i have to click on the code aim is selected right now so i have to write this code for the aim so when green flag click forever go to mouse pointer okay so go to control first go to event when green flag clicked control forever okay then inside the forever go to mouse pointer okay so motion and from the motion we have to select go to mouse pointer okay so now when you click green flag whenever you move your mouse your aim will be moved as per the mouse pointer okay now the next thing which we have to create for the sprite balloon so select now sprite balloon okay right now select the costume this one and come again to the code okay and now go to this particular thing that you have to create for the balloon so start creating it like first green flag click then show then switch costume to balloon okay so event green flag clicked okay then show from the looks you have to select show okay then switch costume to balloon so switch costume to balloon okay then clear graphic effect you have to take clear graphic effects okay then you have to take set size to 50 percent so set size to 50 percent okay 50 percent then go to x minus 80 and y minus 70 so from the motion motion you have to select go to x minus 80 okay and y minus 170 y minus 170 okay then go to forever so from the control go to forever okay now inside the forever you have to point in direction zero move 10 steps okay so from motion 
point in direction zero okay point in direction zero and move to 10 steps so move to 10 steps okay then change size by minus one so from looks change size by minus one okay minus one then if block you have to use so i'm going to use the if block from control so then you will if block inside this block you have to put the uh, operator okay greater than operator so go to operators and select this greater than operator here now inside this greater than you have to put y position so go to move select the y position okay this is the y position and put it here and write it here less than 180 okay oh greater than 180 okay so then put hide here so go to looks and select hide from here okay then go to the next if block touching aim then okay so now you have to go to control and you have to select one more if block below this one if block okay so one if is ended here now you have to start next if now you have to select touching aim so you have to go to sensing and you have to select touching aim okay touching aim sprite then you have to do next costume change color effect by 25 so next costume okay go to the looks and select the next costume and change effect by change effect color effect by 25 and then say boom you have one for one second okay so you have to go to look block you have to use say block you have to use say block and you have to write boom you have one okay so i am going to write here boom you have one okay for one second so i am putting here for one second okay then hide and next costume so again you have to go to looks you have to select hide and you have to use next costume okay so like this now my script is ready now you have to play the game so see i'm going to play the game now so when i click on the green flag okay now see it is coming so i have to target it where it is there okay so you have to move very fast see it is said that boom you have you have won okay so you have to just move your mouse cursor over the balloon okay as soon as you see the balloon you have to move the mouse cursor over the balloon okay so like this you have to create this game or you can make it two seconds you can see it for a more time okay so i am making it three seconds see okay like this so this is the small game which we have created in the scratch okay so okay you have to follow all these things and then you can able to create it so you have to follow the steps properly every steps you have to follow and you have to do the things you can use this video again and again to see how i am doing all the things which will help you to create this game. This video is going to help you to create this game properly. Okay.